We're here today to talk about Mr. Hall. And I'm here to thank him for being him. Definitely count on him for a lot of things. I have counted on him for a lot of things, and I know that when I need him, if I message him, if I text him, he'll be there. During my time at Kent, Miss G has literally been my second mother. She immediately took me under her wing when she saw I was struggling, and even when I wanted to give up, she would pull me aside and get me back on my feet. What is this? <laughs> Hi, how are you? Good. I can say that I'm absolutely, astronomically, stupendously <laughs> honored that you were my advisor. Obviously, the Feelings Mutual, Ash has been great the last three years and she's always that kid who knows how to pick up a, a team that might be <laughs> feeling a little down. What's really special about you is, you know, you're a kid who, you know, one of the things I've talked a lot to the team about is football is a thing that you do, it's not like who you are and like you completely embodied that. I was terrible at soccer. I was easily the worst on the team. And no matter how terrible I was, Miss G was always um, kind of encouraging me to get better. So I think this is something that we used to go back and forth about during soccer, is that you're not a terrible soccer player. <laughs> um, we won't get into the, the nitty gritty there, but yeah, obviously through those little conversations, um, we developed the relationship and you've definitely changed a lot since, since your first year. I recognize that Jordan sees me as his advisor and his coach, but for me, you know, Jordan has become almost like a son to me. 